Hello my friends, are you worried about the economy? Are you worried that work is going to dry up? What if I told you there was a solution? Throughout history, the economy has gone up through booms and busts and downs and ups. And but when the economy does recover, are you going to be positioned in a place where you're going to be the go-to person? You're going to be the go-to solution to your client's pain points? Throughout history, there's been three main decisions that has really come into effect when it comes to purchasing decisions. The first is an emotional connection that we have with a service provider or a product. What emotional reaction do you give or what story do you tell when it comes to your product or service? How do you make your client feel when they work with you? How do you make that customer when they buy that product with you feel? The next is a need or a want specifically when they look to use you, right? Because we don't have a need or a want. There's no reason for us to purchase this product or service that you offer and this amazing solution. So what need do you serve? How do you make the customer or the client's journey easier? And how can you create that sense of fear of missing out for people who don't use you or your service or your product, depending on what you sell and how you sell it? How do we help your target audience feel like they're missing out on something if they don't work with you? Does working with you come with a sense of status, a sense of honor? Is it risky to work with you? Is it going to build confidence with your target audience? Is it going to allow your audience to really feel confident about what you're selling and how you're going to help them move forward with your product? This leans in to the final decision that we make when it comes to purchasing decisions, which is brand or reputation. Arguably one of the most important decisions or the purchasing methods or the reasons why we make our purchasing decisions. Are you a new business going into the market? What credibility do you have? How can you articulate that through your trusted clients, your trusted resource of people you've worked with before? So it isn't just you saying, yes, of course I'm good at what I do, because of course we're going to, but we're biased. So how do you remove that bias and add a bit more social element or social proof into your marketing? What if I told you you could hit all three of these purchasing decisions just by using an effective video marketing strategy that works bespoke to your business and increases your reputation, increases the level of storytelling and emotion that you have when it comes to your business and also make sure that you're positioned as the only solution to the problem that you fix for your clients or your customers. Don't take my word for it. Here is what our clients say about working with us. Oh, again, great to work with uh, Carlton and Richard on this uh, project today. From the outset, good to have a catch up with Carlton in terms of the brief, what I wanted to get from the event, the planning beforehand, which always helps to make sure that what we actually produce on the day is in line with what I want, what the outcome that I want to produce and the trailer that eventually goes out to, to market my, my business, my services. I am, and also the team are really impressed. You know, I would love to say that we did lots of things in advance, but it was very quick and nervous, and Carlton and the team were able to, uh, within the space of a week, go from initial conversation to actually executing everything. And I was really impressed with that. We were able to fit uh, quite a lot into the day, uh, more than I thought we could get, which was great. And also the fact that I didn't have to, I had an idea of what I wanted, but there was, it wasn't like, it was just up to me. There was some advisory both sides as to what we can do and what's most beneficial. Very easy to work with and we'll always go the extra mile in helping make everything that you're looking for work. Not just, I think, within my industry as such. I mean, we've been doing video tours and presenter-led videos. And I mean, me as a business owner, for example, you know, I get very sort of shy to um, get in front of the camera and I always find it quite nerve wracking. But what I would say is the more that you do, the easier it becomes. And it's like anything in life, the, the more you practice at it, the, it then becomes sort of natural and, uh, you know, part of what you do. So um, I certainly think that video is the way to go um, and not just in doing what I do for example with sort of you know um, videos around property etc people don't just want to see videos around property they don't just want to see me presenting videos they want to actually have an insight to what we do and it's all about what we do behind the camera in real life that's what people want to see and I think that video certainly gets that across and is what people are looking for. People are on Instagram Reels, people are on TikTok, people are on LinkedIn. People are consuming video. And when someone consume, 
consumes video, automatically your personality comes across. So if you want to create that bond with your potential clients, with your clients, if you want to accelerate that know, like and trust factor, then you can't afford not to be using video. I think a lot of it is looking at return on investment and everything costs something. And to really market to an audience, especially on the likes of social media, on websites and other things, uh, video content gets people and grabs people t people's attention a lot more than other content like text and like text or imagery. And it's a really good way to showcase what you do because, especially when you're doing mini interviews of senior leaders, they're you know, not many people have been in front of the camera before and having that right approach of, okay, it's professional, it's working, but also um, that light hardness and that kind of ice breaking element, I think was really good. Yeah, we know that Colton has, is very influential um, in, in and around Salisbury, uh, especially with the video content. I'd definitely recommend working with Colton if you need you know, any sort of help or guidance with any of your uh, sort of digital marketing. I would love to hear from you about how we can support you in your growth journey why not book a call using the box below this video and i'll see you very very soon